Welcome to the Lotus Goddess Divine Love. Hi everyone, how's everyone doing today? Hope you're doing well and staying safe. Welcome back everyone. Welcome if you're new to my channel. I do Divine Mask and Divine Feminine Twin Flame Journey Chart Meetings. Let's see what message comes through. There's a divine masculine who wants to leave. They may have even said this to a karmic person. So the karmic person, uh, just keep in mind, could be a family member, a friend, a romantic partner. Just take it as it resonates. This uh, divine masculine has told this, um, this karmic person that they want to leave. I see here they've communicated this with this person. This karmic person is not... The reaction that I see here is that they're trying their best to delay the moving or the the movement or they're trying to hold Divine Masculine in, down in some sort of way. So it's like to keep them stuck. So if there's something that this Divine Masculine needs to do in order for them to, to move forward, there's a lot of delay being caused here by this person. I see here Divine Masculine feels driven to make a change. They feel that this is the time for them to to move forward in some sort of way. They feel divinely guided. They want to start a new path. They feel stuck. Um, this karmic person, whatever that they say to this Divine Masculine to delay the movement or to keep them stuck in some sort of way, I do see that this Divine Masculine feels like whatever they say or do, it it does create some sort of obstacle for this Divine Masculine. I see here that they don't feel strong enough to just leave or to just move forward without, without any kind of delays here because there's something, it's like kind of like dangling something over Divine Masculine's head like you cannot leave because of this reason. There, there is some sort of obligation to stay or to to stay longer. Um, I see that there is some kind of attachment or some kind of bond to the situation. Divine Masculine is following their, their divine guidance to move forward. They do feel tired, exhausted with the situation. They are wondering if there's any way out of their current situation. They're thinking about it. They're thinking really hard about it. When this Divine Masculine thinks about a new beginning or moving forward or changing something in their life, they do think about Divine Feminine here. It's like the Divine is, is starting to show glimpses of Divine Feminine. It's like happiness equals divine feminine. Peace equals divine feminine. Love equals divine feminine. I see here that they're connecting certain emotions, feelings, the type of life that they want, that peaceful, loving life that they desire. They see that connection with you. And it shows here that the divine is showing divine masculine glimpses of divine feminine. Kind of like to pay attention to their feelings because there is a lot having to do with their emotions and keeping focus on that. It's like if you focus on what you feel, what you truly desire, your heart's desire, it will lead you to, to your path. It, would lead, it will lead you towards your wish fulfillment. And I see here that the feelings that they feel within, once this Divine Masculine taps into that, they will be led on a path which will eventually lead to their wish fulfillment. One of their wish fulfillments is to have a beautiful life, a loving life, and that is connected to Divine Feminine here.
this divine masculine wants a good good life. I see here a commitment, a really loving a loving bond, a relationship where they can feel feel balanced, feel equal, feel like they don't have to try so hard. Because this is somebody who when they were in this connection with this karmic person, they felt like they were the one who had to give a lot to that connection or that relationship. Whether it was a family member, whoever it may be, this Divine Masculine felt like they had to give a lot of love, energy to that connection, that relationship. They felt like they were not getting much in return. I see here, even when this Divine Masculine had this desire or passion to to pursue something, so like pursue a goal or a dream, it was shut down by this person. Rather than giving Divine Masculine the encouragement or the strength or the motivation to pursue what they want to pursue, this person discouraged Divine Masculine in different ways. One of them was to show lack of interest in whatever Divine Masculine was doing. So I do see something about this Divine Masculine. If they had some sort of talent, some kind of talent that's like, that could have taken them into a new kind of career or a new kind of path. Whenever this Divine Masculine tried to get it started or to start it up, it could be even a business. This person really discouraged Divine Masculine. They showed lack of interest. They didn't want to communicate much to Divine Masculine whenever Divine Masculine had an idea or a thought or a plan about pursuing what they wanted to pursue. But I do see here that they may have mentioned this dream to Divine Feminine at one point in their life. And the response that they got from Divine Feminine was quite different from what they get from this person here. I see that when this Divine Masculine shared this idea or this thought or this dream that they had with Divine Feminine, even if it was brief, Divine Feminine talked about the, the work that is involved in trying to, to pursue something like that. So it was like as if Divine Feminine was giving genuine advice that if you're planning to do this, you know, you need to keep this, this, this in mind as well. Maybe do some more research on it. Maybe talk to other people who are also um, pursuing that. So I feel that this Divine Feminine showed support by giving some kind of feedback or, or information or some you contributed in some sort of way, you provided knowledge where this Divine Masculine felt like, oh, I, I never knew that or I never thought about it that way. You know, it got Divine Masculine thinking and this really not only encouraged Divine Masculine, but this Divine Masculine was was amazed by how you you reacted or or the insight that you gave when they shared this thought with you because I don't think this Divine Masculine received that kind of feedback before when it comes to their dreams or their goals. And especially in this karmic connection, um, this karmic situation where this Divine Masculine, when they, they felt that they should pursue it or they tried to pursue whatever this was, this person showed a lack of interest and it made Divine Masculine second guess if they were good enough if they were ready to do it, if this is something that they should be doing. So they created some sort of doubt and lack of confidence in this Divine Masculine, where, where in some cases this Divine Masculine didn't even take the first step. It, it, remained, it remained a plan. It remained a dream. It, it never left the ground. Like this Divine Masculine, if they were with Divine Feminine, I feel like they... Currently, they would be in the middle of it, meaning that whatever dream that they wanted to pursue, they would already be doing it and they would have probably mastered it by now, meaning that they would have known, they would have known like top to bottom what was going on. But in this case, this Divine Masculine, they didn't, they didn't budge because of the lack of support from this person. 
So this is the reading for today. I hope you like this reading. If you like my readings, please subscribe to my channel. Leave a comment below. And thank you all for watching. Have a beautiful day. Bye, everyone.